program started off in uh, 2002, building on some of the uh, best practice in negotiation teaching that we were aware of, and also building in a lot of things that we felt were missing from programs up till then. Negotiations is a fundamental activity which people do every day of their lives in organisations. And many of the people who come on the programme are both negotiating internal to their organisation but also externally. Uh, many of them are extremely experienced but need an opportunity to reflect on what they do so that they can improve and become more effective in their day-to-day -day challenges. Many people go into negotiation with the idea that it's a competitive sport, that there's, there's winners and losers. Uh, and our ethos on the programme is, is, no, it's not a competitive sport. Uh, it's, it's an opportunity to create value both for yourself and your counterpart. Uh, and in particular, negotiation can be learned. I needed to brush up on my negotiation skills because my company is expanding and we're moving into more international uh, business deals. And when I saw the negotiation programme, I said, yes, that's the one for me. It's the participants. I mean, I mean it's a fantastic group of people, frankly. I'd never been in a group with that incredible diversity. You know, the mix was just fantastic. You know, you're sitting here at a table and negotiating with somebody from Nigeria is just an incredible experience. What we're trying to achieve is actually help people to reach agreements that work, which does draw attention to the fact we pay attention to uh, implementation as well. It's, it's no good knowing how to do it if we can't make it actually work in practice. There's always a variety of different issues that, that both yourself and your counterpart uh, can bring to the table which can add a lot more value. Uh, and what we, what we certainly talk about in negotiation is the more differences between yourself and your counterpart. That's not a negative thing. That creates the opportunity to create more value to both sides. And to cover so much ground in, in a week is very worthwhile. It makes you feel you're really getting something out of the programme. Uh, the way that it's taught with, with case studies but also with a lot of use of, of, of lectures and insights from the storytelling of the, of the people that have really you know, done the business on the ground that, that teach this programme. And, and that, I think, makes, makes quite a difference. We are not giving a lesson about what you need to do in a negotiation. We are trying to give people a framework to think through the negotiations, which they then have to reflect upon in the context that they have. But the way in which participants typically do that is by exchanging insights and views from their own experience with other participants. So having a, a diversity of opinion in the, rule, in the room, having a lot of experience from different sectors, from different countries, uh, from uh, different types of negotiations, whether public sector and private sector, can all make the experience much, much richer than it would be otherwise. We hope you'll come to your negotiations as you, when you enter the workplace again with a, a whole list of questions, almost a tick box of things that you need to address which you wouldn't have considered before. One of the things I think I'll take back was to keep everything on the table because I think I had a tendency to go after each point. I wanted to, you know, nail that point and then move to the next point. But just keeping everything on play on the table I think was so significant and, and we had to practice that a lot and that's definitely something I'll be I'll be doing in the future.